Now you know I need a new vehicle, like a hole in the head. But we're going to look at one anyway. today. This is a 79 Dodge Camper Special. Long bed. This is a 360. Doesn't run. I guess there's some card things and uh, there's no spark. The little distributors. Distributor pickups like we screwed. Or the little electronic ignition box. This would be one of the first years of the electronic shit. Not too different than what was in the Windsor. Power steering. battery compartment rusted out. Uh, might have been a two battery at one point when it was a camper. That's what it looks like. Yeah, because there's the uh, whatever heat sink bus bar. Base truck. Oh, there's an old it's ventilated. That's the air conditioning right there. That's for keeping your balls cool. Eighty-five thousand. Those are likely to be kilometers. Where's the radio? AM. Seen a lot worse. Unfortunately, I'm not sure how much of that you got. So I think the battery ran out in the middle of it. We'll see when I get home. You see, it's a Sierra 2500, not a Suburban. Not a suburban though.
that is also 800 bucks just like the truck it's had a lot of things done to it well in the body anyway just can't see shit here Imagine the plywood that is uh, tech screwed down to the back is covering a pretty large hole. Anyway, I don't know. I guess they didn't excite the shit out of me, but I'd say if that if that Dodge truck had a slant six, I'd be going to the bank right now. And that suburban thing, I mean, it would only be worth doing if you didn't have to do really anything to it, like just let it grow. You know, use it until it's done, kind of thing. But they might have already done that. I don't know what year that was, but probably the same age as the, you know, 78, 79. Alright, well, I don't know how much of an adventure that was, we'll see, I guess. If the camera died before I even got to the truck, then that's, I don't know, might invalidate this whole fucking thing, but... Um, talk soon? Yeah.